Hey, what's good everybody? This is B Does NFL back with another video. Oh, let me get this camera at a position so you guys can, can see. Alright. Well, I'm gonna have to change the name of the of the channel, man. I can't find any any NFL cards. Might have some in a few days, but uh I was able to locate a couple boxes. I guess they're hanger boxes of these 2020 Bowman Platinum baseball cards. So, like to rip packs. Uh, yeah, I mean, I like all sports. I prefer football. I don't know too much about baseball. Also got a got this one here. It's a four exclusive artists proof parallels per box. Uh, seven packs, one bonus pack, four cards per bo per pack, thirty two cards. Um, obviously we'd be hoping for something special, you know, let's see, cut signature, oh, that'd be cool, that's only one in 280,326, so we'll probably get two, uh, there's the, the statistics, I guess you call them, or odds, if you want to check that out, and then with this one is a fine two IC parallels and two numbered parallels per box, uh, I assume there's autographs that if you're really lucky you can possibly get, uh, there's the, that, yeah, the, is that the odds? I guess that's the odds right there. Um, geez, not much there. Anyhow, hoping to pull something, some fire, something, something of value, something nice. So uh, let's go ahead and get started. We'll start off with one of these uh, hanger boxes, I think. 24 cards per box. They just, just need one hit, right? Just takes one, huh? Oh, he's got it. <clears throat> Quit puff off the vape. Oh, the it's open. Oh, okay, cool. It's on the sides. Oh, wow. Oh, that's well, it's kind of neat, I guess. I mean, just one, one pack. Okay, then. One, uh, one pack. So, <clears throat> kind of neat. Go ahead and rip rip it open, huh? Check it out. Alright, off the, the bat. We don't see any we don't see any fat cards in there, but uh who knows, huh? Who knows? Alright. Let's check these out. They're nice looking cards. Slow collecting cards, man. So we got a rookie. Let's see how this one are. Is that his name? Bichette? Yep, Bo Bichette. That's the back of him. Nothing really uh, spectacular. Cool looking cards. It's like a... They're all like that. I guess that's the base. Those are reflective, like foil looking. <clears throat> Next we got uh, Jordan Yamamoto. Yamamoto. Sorry if I hacked that up. Jordan. Oh, these are uh, riveting. George Solar. Yep, Solar. Jose Ramirez. Nick. Nick, what's your last name? Senzel. Nick Senzel. <clears throat> yeah, beautiful cards, I guess. All right, next we got a uh, Jack. Uh, Flarty, Flarty, Flowerty. <laughs> Yo, that's a cool name, Ryu. <laughs> Neat, Toronto. <clears throat> Acuna Jr. Uh, Raphael Devers. Joey Vota. Oh, what's behind this one? Something, something worthwhile, something neat. Anthony Rizzo. Yeah, that is, that is look, nice looking. I'll check that out. I got got the reflective don't know if that's anything special but uh behind that looks like we got another another one these ones numbered no we got a anthony arizzo <clears throat> just looking for like special inserts or something something neat you know something nice huh there's a decent one behind it riley green and this one is numbered <clears throat> Uh, 196 out of 199. Almost made it there, huh? 
And who's this next one? Brett Beatty, 81 out of 299. So I guess this one's a little bit more rare, huh? And it's uh, Gunnar Henderson. Gunnar. Uh, <clears throat> Orioles. And uh, Brett Batty. An interesting name. Hey, look, at that, look at that face, isn't it? Jeez, it looks so excited. I guess I'd be too, huh? Now we'll see if we can to find anything else uh, halfway decent. <clears throat> uh, boring, <laughs> boring, boring, boring. Oof, yikes, boring, boring. Uh, what do we got here? Boring, boring. Oh, that was cool. So I got exactly what it said in the box, nothing else whatsoever. That was, um, I don't know if I'll be buying these again. <laughs> Can't uh, can't say that can't say I like them too much. It's actually, I mean, I, I don't know, kind of, kind of boring. But I don't know. No, it's always boring unless you get something good, right? Let's check out this next box, dude. This one's got the fire in it, right? Something halfway, uh, halfway decent with our uh, one pack again. Oh, no, don't don't feel too heavy. I'm packing for it. All right. Oh man, should have stuck with a uh, should have stuck with football cards. These are these are kind of brutal. I'll we'll just go through these boring, 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 boring. Yeah, since I don't know like about football or the names of these people who they actually are it's kind of difficult to gauge whether uh whether they're actually worth anything although i can assume these base cards are worthless so oh there's what's this one ah that one's neat it's gonna be just like the other pack i would assume very cool card though not numbered and then this next one i should be numbered bladay 215 out of 250. Wow. Wow, this one's a 13 out of 150. Abrams. Okay. And will there be anything else of uh, any type of uh well nope, that's awesome. <laughs> so yeah, not nothing too special in that one. That's uh I'm understanding. Uh, yikes. Yikes. Maybe this one would be better, huh? Four exclusive artist truth parallels per box. And uh, let's check it out. I assume this one will not be one pack. The Art of Collecting it says 2020. All right, let's... No, this is like a plaster box. Get those out of here, huh? Whoops. Oh, these feel, uh, this is interesting. Huh. Oh, kind of. I don't know, it's four cards per pack. This one must be, uh, I guess, the four exclusive artist proof parallels inside, huh? Neat. That's a like a topper. I don't know if you guys play Madden. I love playing Madden. It's like a topper. All right, let's check it out. See what we got here. All right, so well, that's kind of neat. I don't know if that's anything like particularly uh, special. No, it's not even numbered, but it's very pretty cool. <clears throat> Let me just. Set these uh, Bowman cards. Oh, that was depressing. George Solar. Ooh, nice cards. Huh. Ricky Henderson, Hall of Fame. I remember him a long time ago. Not numbered. Bummer. And I guess this is the base card. There's the back of it. Not exactly uh, riveting, but again, nice, 
Very nice. Four cards, four more. I think the odds in getting something good are like one in a million, I believe is what it said. No, <laughs> might as well be. Uh, Alex Bregman. Okay. Tommy Can Tunnel Tunnel. Interesting. Hey, is this some something neat here? Wow, that's a that's a really cool looking card. Oh, that's a nice like holographic. I don't know if you guys see that, but yeah, that's neat. I mean, not neat enough to number, but still, pretty cool. Pretty cool. One second. And the last one is Nolan Arenado. So that was a neat card. Some type of insert. And the next next pack. Yeah, I, don't know, I like it. They're like football cards. I don't know who these guys are. Travis Dimitri. Uh, Nick Birdie. Master and Apprentice, huh? Well, that's cool. Pretty cool. Don Mattingly and Aaron Judge. Neat. I guess each one has like an insert. Uh, no autos on any of this. Alright, on to the next one. Bad boy open here. All right, James Karen Jack. Framer Valdez, and it looks like all right. I know that's that ain't real. Thought I had auto. Pretty sure it's just uh I'm not sure what this <laughs> is to be quite frank, but it that is definitely not an authentic autograph though. Looks like it is top to a heritage. Vladimir Guerrero. But uh yeah, he definitely that's like printed on there, so yeah, I don't think he wouldn't recommend running out and grabbing some of these. I mean, granted, they're, I mean, unless you're really into baseball, so. but, uh, pack-wise, not seeing, like, not seeing too much fire, really, I mean, got the numbered cards that were guaranteed, so that's, <laughs> anyway, Robel Garcia, boring, Juan Soto, maybe this would be some, like, super refractor, I don't know, I don't think so, Anthony Rizzo, Numbered to nothing. And that one's got to be at least worth at least worth nothing, right? I mean, Mike King. Wow, man, these are these are uh, these brutal, man. Like, Ronald Acuna Jr. Blake Snell. Yeah, what's this? Uh, is this no nothing there. Donald, Donald, Josh Donaldson, and a, no, it says, a, oh, Artisans. Oh, okay. I guess there, there's a difference if it's on the side. Interesting. Hmm. Well, nonetheless, you have to see any fire unless it's the last pack of those uh, artist proof parallels. Those are some freaking amazing. This uh, this, this pack sucks. It's bad. Jacob Degrom, boring. Matt Chapman, anything decent? Bo Bichette. Oh, it's a rookie at least, huh? That's cool. I don't know if he's a good rookie, but yeah, very cool looking card though. 
Yeah, Bo Bichette. Okay, and uh, Logan Webb. And now for the topper or the final pack, which is four exclusive artist proof parallels inside. Never seen these before in my life. I think the way those packs went probably the last time I ever will. All right, let's uh, let's see what these ones look like, huh? Ards proof uh, Kyle Schwarber. Now, it, I don't know if it's just me, but they seem to look I just like the base card, except for it says artist proof. Okay, so that's a uh, rookie, Anthony K. Oscar Hernandez, and Brendan McKay. Any of them numbered? No. And no. Wow. So, here's the artist proof. This is the, actually, he's a, we'll, we'll set the rookie over here because who knows, maybe he's something decent. I doubt it. Here's the artist proof and here's the regular. <laughs> Yeah. Okay. That's kind of boring. Anywho. Hey, it is what it is. Well, hey, thanks for hanging out. And uh, like, subscribe, comment. You know, come more importantly, come back and check out some more videos, man. I'll be back. And I hope you guys have a good one. Later.